Danny Batewell and community organizers met today to discuss a strategic plan on how to address community police relations, education, and the importance of leveraging entrepreneurial strength in the community. So listen, this is an opportunity not just to talk about the challenges in the African American community, but it's also a growth opportunity around jobs, around employment, around things that are really important. Should I say, I think it's clear that they, they are less valued. I believe that we have been treated as um, three-fifths. We never come to that place in America where we are looked upon as a 100% human. It's important to keep in mind when talking about real life people that deserve the most respect, protection. They need also a sense of fulfillment and well-being and security and flourishing. And so when we talk about it, we need that and we need to struggle to make sure that it happens. We have a long history of working through tough situations. Uh, and we know that when we challenge power, uh, when we get organized, uh, when we protest, when we picket and we say there is not going to be business as usual until we get justice, we move the needle. We need to be able to vote on putting people in power so that we can hold them accountable. We need to, uh, the, uh, the younger generation has to really engage in the political process and understand. Tom, it's really just about meeting the people where they are and that once you build that relationship, then they can begin to hear what you have to say. We're working with our own people, we're developing the economic systems, the educational systems, and we're employing our own. Watch and see the respect we get. There was a day when the leaders of the community were as follows. The physicians, uh, the principal, the professors, then the parents and the preacher. And in that order, the parents, the preacher, uh, the professors and the principals and the physicians. And now we have literally taken that out and we don't hardly know who is in fact the heroes and leaders of our community.